The Hamilton Tiger Cats take on the Saskatchewan Rough Riders Saturday in Guelph. It's the rematch from last weekend's loss. Tiger Cats lost 37 nothing in the opener of this home and home set. I'm here with respect, Steve Milton. Steve, what did the Tiger Cats have to do the second time around to change the result? Well, shed the negative momentum right away, and I think they've got to come out right away. And we've said this before: this team has to score first, in my mind. For too many years, and I know this is. You know, Ken Dawson and his group want, only want to talk about this year, but even this year, too often when you when you have to score, it makes it too difficult on the offense. So they've got to start feeling good about their defense, and and they certainly couldn't have felt good about it last week. So they've got to make some big physical defensive plays right off the top. That, that to me, that's the most important thing right off the top. Defense has been a story this week. Uh, linebacker Marky Knowlton, a stalwart here over the last five or six years, uh, released uh, this week. Uh, Nate Bussey looks like he'll get the start at the weak side linebacker spot. Uh, will he make a difference uh, with Marky Knowlton gone? Well, I, I, I think that they're trying to get a little more physical at the linebacker spot, and uh, and, and if he can bring that, then that, that's important. They've got to do something about the run, particularly up the middle at the start of the game. It didn't. They didn't, uh, I guess... Even though they lost 37 nothing last week, uh, one positive point is there wasn't a 70-yarder in the first 16 minutes right up the middle. And all of them put pretty well right up the gut. They've got, and, and if he can fill that box, and, and uh, if, to me the Cats are probably going to have to, to, to uh, stunt a little more, do a little more things. They've got to get to the quarterback much more quickly. But the first thing is stop that run. Um, they've got the best rusher in the league right now. He's averaging more per game than the uh, Thai Cats tailbacks have total this season. Make sure you check out Saturday Spectator for a full game preview as well as the Scratching Post blog for all the up-to-the-minute Ticat news reporting from Hamilton Tiger Cat headquarters on Jarvis Street with the Spec Steve Milton. I'm Drew Edwards.